All right, morning guys. 5.30 in the morning, gonna hook up the boat. Looks like it's starting to break up. It's been raining the last couple of days. Gonna go down the pine and um, put some crab pots in and see if the um, theory of rain brings the crabs out, fresh water. So I'll hook the boat up, I'll come back to you soon. So the boat's hooked up. Loaded up last night, I got six pots. Um, taking my daughter out with me today so I can throw in a couple of pots. Um, what we're gonna do today, couple in the mud, couple in the sand, try a bit of both. Not expecting much, but give it a go. Right, eh? So it's six o'clock, boats loaded, cars loaded. Uh, 9.30 high tide, so we'll get a couple of hours of the run in. Hopefully, I think it's meant to rain oh, around lunchtime, 12 o'clock or something. Shut the shit up here. Um, meant to rain around lunchtime, so we'll get out, sink these pots for a bit, maybe have a bit of a fish, get the drone up in the sky. See what happens, I guess. About seven o'clock. Got my little helper. Um, yeah. There's fishies. Yeah. Right, uh, what we're gonna do? We're gonna head up towards the Horny Brook. Um, we'll put some pots in. We'll you We got some dolphin fish from our trip on Frenzy Charters. We've got some frames left, so we'll chuck them in and see if they want some dolphin fish. Um, all right, you ready, Lex? Yeah. You hold on. All right, so we're loading the first pot up. A bit of dolphin fish. We'll see if they interested. What's up? Give me one second and I'll get you something. I'll put this in. Bit of dolphin fish, see if that does the trick, eh? What's that? That's bait. That's dolphin fish? That is dolphin fish, yeah. Oh. Throw a zip tie on here. Cause you never know. All right, you hold on, Lex. We're gonna go. All right, so we've drifted over the other side of the river. Is it crabs? We're gonna try get some crabs. Yeah. Crabs. I'm gonna put two along this bank. Over here, you can see straight ahead of us. Sort of muddy, mangrovey area. Now I'm going to head up towards the bridge a bit more, the Hornybrook Bridge. And I'll probably put four in the sand today. See if I can catch a sandy. I've never actually caught sandies. Haven't really caught muddies either, but you can only try, right? So we'll head over here. Uh, it's about a metre. Got the first pot. Looks pretty mangrovey. A little bit of bait flopping around, so we'll give it a go, eh? And we'll put one over here somewhere. Let's 
We will put it right about here. One and a half meters of water. And we'll give that a go, eh? So the other couple will head up here onto the sand flats and try and get a couple of sandies, I reckon. Two meters looks good to me. So this is the last pot, we'll go up here near the bridge. Ah, fucking. Righto, so that's all the pots in. Reassess the situation, get the rod out. Might have a little fish while we wait and uh, see how we go. on the first pot that we put in this morning. Uh, these two were in the mangroves in the muddy area. So we'll go in, we'll grab them. All right, we'll go back a bit, we'll get out of here. We'll see if there's anything in here, eh, Lex? Nothing. We got nothing. Again. Yeah. Nothing. <laughs> All that for one little crab. Can you see him? No, it's a crab, but he's got barnacles growing on him. Is he? Here's a buck, just a very undersized one. So these are the last two, we're up near the bridge. Um, sand flats. Nothing. Yeah, I got it. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. So 
So we did all that this morning. It's what, 11 o'clock, heading back home. One undersized buck. Wasn't expecting much, not really a crabber. Maybe do it once or twice a year for a bit of fun. Put in for a day off yesterday, last minute notice kind of thing. Um, and then thought, hey, why not take the boat down, put the pots in, have a bit of fun, get the drone in the air, beat the band at work, right? So we'll get home, we'll clean the boat, put it away, and that's about all the adventuring done for today. Catch us later.